What's going on, everybody? Eddie Soundhead back once again with Soundhead Entertainment, and we are back in Wreckfest once again here today, trying on something a little bit different and something new once again here. We are at Bristol, the newly updated Bristol once again, but this time it is covered in dirt, and we have got the Class B cars out again, and we have got an absolute abomination on wheels, which is kind of what I was going for. Figured you'd probably see this at a local dirt track somewhere in the world, so... We're gonna tear it up here and uh, see if we can get that dub. And off we go here, and I'm just gonna get straight to that outside with a bit of a run. This is a bumpy, pumpy racing surface. And that's gonna be fun to deal with once we get a little bit more up to speed. Some guys are going around and crash before we're even up to speed though. We got trucks flipping at the bottom of the racetrack. We got one upside down and flipping into the catch fence at the top of the racetrack. There is carnage everywhere, including right in front of us in the racing lane. We got Kawiki up on two wheels. Three wide and Bristol, not where you want to be. Ricky Craven coming back up to finish us off, you waste. And it's a pile up of massive proportions. And we're just going to fight our way through it. That has been an alarmingly destructive opening lap. Look, it's everybody's favorite driver, Kyle Busch. Go ahead and remove him from the scene real fast and carry on with our day. No big deal. Oh my goodness, though. We have a ton of carnage on the front stretch once again, and that's a direct pack to the back of the station wagon. Just powered through it. I took Todd Gill into the wall and I took myself out of this thing as well. Turn for me, you bump. Yeah, this thing's already taking a beating and driving it is becoming a bit of a task, especially when this car is laying dead in the road and everywhere. Look at this mess. What am I doing? It's just like a skate grind across that burn and then I crashed into a car that was stuck on top of it. You hate to see it. That is anti-neat the jumps that are just like baked into the track make me very happy oh man there's some flipping going on that guy stuck the landing too and kept on going we're sliding right underneath it and sliding off the corner but keeping it going underneath jeffrey and here we go all oh, more guys hard to the outside wall and that is gonna land on top of us Haley digging is flipping way into the air into the space force oh jeffrey's gonna get oh jeffrey with the send and he missed and he pays the price that's what you get. That is a Terminator getting defeated in its most beautiful form. Watch out in front of us, though. We're going to have some carnage. Got people slowing down right in the racing lane. We got a collection of cars down at the bottom. Eric Jones hard to the wall. Oh, man. He and Christopher Bell are like, no, I'm the better TRD development driver. No, I'm the better TRD development driver. No, I'm the better student of Kyle Busch. No, I'm the better student of Kyle Busch. Well, I'll just remove both of you from the race, or maybe we can all crash together. Oh, no. Oh, well, I got rid of Eric Jones. Christopher Bell will be happy about this. I am not happy about wrecking this thing. We got to keep it going. I'm getting running two from behind. I think that rivalry died right then and there in front of our eyes. Well, Uncle Wiki has brought home the dub. Good for him. It's uh, only fitting for him to bring it home at Bristol. And uh, we'll limp across the line here for fifth. We'll try the outside. We've tried the inside. Uh, let's try up the middle. Oh, I don't like how this is going already. The squeeze, the squeeze. We've got Ricky Craven up on two wheels again. And everybody's crashing to the outside while parts just come flying from off screen. That is a beautiful sight. It's when you know something grand has happened just off camera. Oh, three cars directly in the wall. That is a beautiful sandwich right in front of my eyes. And then the car decides not to turn and we go to the wall, but we're going to pass a few more anyway. Now, let's see. Will this pack of cars up here crash? Of course they will. They just pile up. And can we get around this or maybe drive through it if we have to? Yes. Oh, no, you bum, you waste. Why would you do this? Oh, that's hard into the wall. We got tipped by a salty driver. And uh, you know what? The Terminators, they got us again. They got us again. We had daylight. And it was robbed of us. Our glory destroyed. Get out of my way, DiBurrito. I have places to be and Terminators to dismantle. Oh, why would you do this? Why would you do this? They only come for me. Look at the state of me right now. Look at the state of me. Our race is killed. It's over. It's long over. Oh, boy. You just love seeing four wide out the windshield. That's really a grand sight to behold. Oh, especially when they all just go flying into the wall. All in one go. And that's the easiest. We've cracked the top 10 thus far, and we're getting pushed into the corner. There's problems in front of us. I'm trying to slow down for it. I'm not going to be able to. And Christopher Bell's up on top of me, hard to the wall. T-Bone and DW. And it's a pile up behind us. There's cars scattering everywhere. And Ken Schrader gets a run on our outside like a beast. Holy send Davy Allison with the send of the century. That did not work out at all. And we are gonna luckily get to a scattered mess there on the front stretch, jeez. 
Oh boy. Man, this is a treacherous part of the track right now. This is the danger zone, and I just sent Johnny Benson into a very early plate. We're going flying Dukes of Hazard style, boys. Right back onto the track. How did we do that? Oh boy. All right. Well, it's not going to be a dump, excuse me, but it is going to be a finish, and it's going to be a podium finish, which is even better. Not bad. Let's see if we can just squeeze it through the middle. Oh, we cleared him. That was beautiful. Those guys are wrecking. See you later. Not even going to look back at it. Oh, no. We got problems in front of us. Kilwicky lost it on the straightaway. It's me and Ty Dillon. Oh, no. Austin Dillon. The Dillon brothers attack. And Austin Dillon's out of the race. And he is getting carried to the fence. Oh, he's riding across the fence. What is he doing? Oh, he's getting destroyed. He is getting absolutely pummeled and annihilated. Absolute savagery on display here. As Austin Dillon just reenacted the old 2015 July race and got pummeled by us all. The poor guy. Oh, somebody's causing a wreck up there that doesn't need to be. That was two cars racing together and it's going to end in me crashing out. No. That's not allowed. All right. So we had to come back here to the replay and see exactly what happened to Austin Dillon. So he gets set up to the wall and then we run right through him. He gets carried back to the wall. Rides up on the safer barrier for a little bit, then gets hit directly in the mouth. Hits some more. Carried down the track a little bit. Just gets absolutely clobbered directly in the face again. Then another AI comes around, just ass packs him, just squares could be. And then we come along, give him a double shot just for his health. Then this little guy comes through, hits some square in the door. That was probably the life ender right there, if I had to guess. Although, who, who's to say? Then these two guys, they didn't even mean to hit him. They were just wrecking, and he happened to be in the way, so... Just kind of an innocent victim on that last one, for sure. And funnily enough, if you pay attention in the background, you'll actually see me coming to my untimely demise as well. Just gonna roll over the side there like a sad little bum. Not sure why I keep trying in the middle. I don't feel like it's working very well for us, but I don't think any side's really working that well for us, so. At least we got clear. I got that to go for me. Maybe the middle is working after all. Maybe I should stop talking crap about it. Bottom's working pretty good right now. I just avoided a big mess on the back straight there. Oh my goodness, these guys are coming together right there. Somebody just got sticky walled back there, it looked like. You absolutely hate to see it. Oh, we got one going sideways in front of everybody. JJ Yaley out of control. But he gathers it up. Referring to myself, that is, I think. Oh, can we get it back together? We can. So did JJ Yaley. What a save by both of us. Hey, high five, JJ. Oh, JJ, no. What are you doing, dude? The ultimate betrayal. What a slug! I can't even think of a creature slimy enough to compare him. What an absolute bum of a man. Oh, and then Haley Diggy just gonna lose it right in front of him. Oh, Jeffrey Earnhardt is gonna drive his way through it and take himself out of the race. You hate to see it. You also hate to see the fact that we have officially lost. GG John Hunter. Oh boy. Yep. Oh, Buddy Baker, you hate to see it, man. I'm sorry. I did not mean to hook you like that, and I'm going to pay the price for it. It would be nice if I could stop getting hooked. It would really be nice if you guys could stop pushing me down the racetrack. That would really be a glorious thing, and they do. They just dispose of me down the side of the berm. Well, thank you, guys. That worked out well for all of you. Look at Eric Jones just going for a tumble at about two miles an hour. Oh, we got another one going flipping right here. That was Haley Deegan, I'm pretty sure, and we are going flying into the inside wall. Not where we want to be. Costing us even more time out here. And there you have it. The race is officially over. DW gets the dub. Good for him. Oh, man. I really don't like being on the outside the most. I think that's the one I like the least. Holy! Launched directly into the Space Force. That was Haley Deegan that just went flying. I can't even get turned around here. They're going to knock me around. That was the biggest pileup I've seen all day. That was huge. We got Terminators coming back up into traffic. Oh, somebody be my path clear my battering ram and that worked beautifully we got right through it oh look it's everybody's favorite nascar driver once again and he's gone and we didn't even take him out but we did take out austin dillon there and we lost a wheel in the process you hate to see it you also wait to see eric jones trying to drive straight through but he's just going to apparently and he does he takes me out it really doesn't get much more cold-blooded than that really don't like this middle Oh, thankfully, I get to the high side. And then the high side's going to get clogged up. Here we go. I should have seen that coming. Oh, my God. Cobbles just got launched. He's flipping, and he's out of the race already. 
Johnny Benson coming with a head of steam. Got to block him. Oh, and then Daniel Suarez just lines himself up for the pack of the day. Ouch. Oh, smoke. We got Reckon. We got a car lane in the middle of the road. And that might be the pack of the day. Actually, I don't know. We've had quite a lot of bad ones today. I don't know that I can just be handing that title out. But that one was bad. That was a two smithereens packing. Two oblivion to Sovereign Guard and all the rest. Infinity and beyond. And I'm getting dumped by Johnny Benson, my guy. One of my fellow Michigan heroes just took me out. John Hunter Nemechek collecting dubs. We're, we're, we're just dying out here. Just let me clear, Eric, please. Nope. 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 Oh, God. Why are we trying to go four wide? Why is Ricky Craven climbing me again? And there we all go to the wall. We were like five wide there for a few seconds. The cars scatter. Why is Eric Jones doing 20 miles an hour in the middle of the road? These are questions that may never be answered. And there's cars just dying up at the top of the track. Oh, clear the gap. And we do right through the middle. Keep it going. Oh, more cars going up to the wall right in front of us here. Oh, this is going to be a pile up right off the corner. Look out. Oh, no. That little black and green car just got pummeled by like four of us. That was we're going to need the funeral meme for that guy. Well, there you go. Austin Dillon gets a nice little rebound for all the destruction and pain he's been through today. We packed somebody right across the line and we actually finished one of these in six. How about that? Oh, keep it together, lads. Come on. Too many cars survived the first few corners. The game doesn't know what to do. There's too many cars in one area. I'm getting shoved through the corner. Oh, I've got no choice. I got nowhere to go. Just keep your foot to the floor. They're piling up. They're going everywhere. We're dumping Ricky Craven. Driving right through him. Cars everywhere behind us. And we're in the top 10. Oh, we got more cars flipping, getting just nailed as cars go by. Oh, we're going to cream a few ourselves. And we're going to sneak our way up to the front and into the lead. Into the lead from JJ Haley. You love to see it. Oh, look at what an absolute junkyard it is. There's not another car in sight. We got one. We got Ricky Craven five seconds back. We can hold on. Oh, we can do it off the final corner. This is going to be it. Eric Jones wrecks and we get to the checkers for the dub. The glorious dub is finally ours lads it's finally ours that was a fairly brutal exchange here with bristol motor speedway that dirt is treacherous it came for our head today and it got it quite a few times and the nascar ai well they they met their match as well even while being in b-class cars that was quite an entertaining day at the track i would say i hope you guys agree i hope you had fun out there i hope you enjoyed it if you guys want to see some more stuff here at Bristol, we will definitely come back. I've been thinking about NASCAR Legends here at Bristol. Not sure whether we should do the paved track or the dirt track. Maybe I'll let you guys decide. Let me know down in the comments below, and we'll figure that out here coming up shortly. So with that, that's pretty much where we're going to start to wrap things down here for this video. If you guys enjoyed it, you know what to do. Be sure to hit that like button for me and subscribe. If you have not already, that stuff helps me out a ton. Of course, you can always give me suggestions, things you want to see from Wreckfest or any other game for that matter down in the comments below and uh yeah that's pretty much where we'll wrap things up here today thank you guys of course for your continued support it means a lot especially in these crazy times hope you're all doing well and with that i will see you all in the next one Boof!